is the Pichu. Okay. Jack was the wolf. Thought it was the other way around. Okay. We're seeing like we're wolf was on the hunt. He just encountered like a, a wild mouse, and he's trying to he's trying to make dinner. Yeah. Oh, this yo, this is yeah. actually like this would be a nature documentary. Yeah. Absolutely. <laughs> just like the wild wolf hunts the uh, hunts his favorite snack, the um the small electricity mouse. I couldn't think of anything else after yeah, that. I, I feel like there's so many avenues for a joke there, and I couldn't think of it. Anyway, Pokemon Stadium is the first pick already. Jackal already looking uh, pretty good, up about a 40%, a 50% differential. Ooh, oh, advancing that all the way up to a 60. And the F-Tilt going to do it against a character as light as Pichu. That wasn't even the strong hit. That was like the little tip of the claws yeah. right there. That was like the that was like the tip of the claws, like the manicure that you get like out <laughs> of the uh, out of the place. You know, like I just got a fresh Manny Petty. You know, it's going to be able to take out a character like Pichu yeah. relatively early. Yeah, exactly. We're gonna see how um, how Ralphie handles like his ledge trapping right now. And just kind of lets him back on the center stage, but yeah, it's still be not great. in the bad spot. Yeah, it's just so interesting because like a character like Wolf, you Ooh, know, right parry. when like optimized, controls space very well with his laser because let's be frank, like no one knows how to fight that thing yet. Yeah, I, I personally like taking the laser. I think that's a good way to go about it. But when you play a character like Pichu, that's not really too optimal of a strategy anyway. But you know what? You really want to watch your jumping specifically against a character like Wolf because yeah. he, he tries to like condition or bait you to jump with the uh, laser neutral B, and then once he does, he's just going to intercept you with one of his aerials, such as the forward air, which combos into itself with the neutral air, which is very strong, and the back air, which is incredibly strong. And if you get hit by that as Pichu, you're going to be dying some pretty wonky percent. So for Pichu, is that F tilt yeah. is going to be able to take the and stock. The, the one thing the about that laser is, is if you're right up close to someone, it's not safe on shield. And Ralphie, knowing that, took the opportunity to get that F tilt to get the kill. Mm, absolutely, very smart character knowledge on his part. Not even just character knowledge, but situational knowledge, you yes. know? Indeed. Yeah. But now this is where Pichu really has to like Pichu, and by that I mean get the mix in. Get that down throw, get those back air uh, resets in, because that is how Pichu tacks up his damage, if you're all uh, familiar with that. Because right now we have a Pichu at uh, 145. This wolf is going to be trying to blow the big bad house down, because pretty much <laughs> all it's going to take is a blow to yeah. be able to kill Pichu right there, as the up tilt is going to do it. Yeah. Oh, oh that reads like that read. are required. Yeah. <laughs> that's required reading. Reads like that, or yo, that that's required reading. Yeah, yo, that's like that's like uh, what what is the book? Uh, that's like the Great Gatsby when they make you read it oh, in like yeah. the fourth grade. That's a required reading fourth right there. Fourth grade? I read that in like high school. So that was like yeah, I read it in high school too. Shout okay. out to summer reading. The teachers ruining our summers everywhere when we're kids. Yeah, shout outs. And the F tilt uh, gonna push him away right there. Jackal up a full stock, looking pretty comfortable, repping his boys in Africa. All right, dash oh, dancing, trying right, to bait yeah. him. Probably definitely trying to catch his landing there. Noticing how like um, Jackal like jumped from ledge a lot. Oh! Ooh. And Ralphie just taking the full Manny yeah, Petty to the face. Yeah, the get up attack was kind of questionable. Could have just waited on ledge or something like. Yeah, I, that was definitely like, a distinct like brief lack of patience on Ralphie's yeah. part right there. If he just waited to like get his uh get up, not his, not even a get up attack. If he just waited a little bit to do anything else like a neutral get up or like a roll or something, it would have been better because like. Because you're, you're not in the danger zone. You're, you're not, not in the danger zone, of course. Yeah. You're not getting hit. I mean, Wolf's F, uh, Wolf's oh, F smash okay. is incredibly fast. It is safe We're on block. the Wolf Ditto. All right. So it is safe on block if he spaces it right. And it looks like he just doesn't. It looks like he's sick of dying. On a successful hunt, the Wolf has claimed the Pikachu. But another Wolf has come to claim the victories. But what's this? Another one, another hunter yeah, from another, another pack. Yeah, exactly. Here to challenge the mate. Be careful, young Jackal. This is a spryly young Wolf fresh from... <laughs> that, uh, I'm sorry. All right, here we go. Jackal, of course, just uh, rocking the red one. Ralphie, the blue one. Getting those little sheet combos in, trying to rock the forward airs. All right, both of them just missing everything. <laughs> they both just missed their lasers and then both immediately tried to do the same thing at neutral air. Yeah. And, all right. Have tilt. Not on block, but he's going to be able to get the grab for his troubles. Forward throw, try to set up a tech chase situation. Ooh. Yeah, Jackal thinking he's gonna roll, but uh, Ralphie not biting, uh, biting the bait. And just fishing there for the back air, as many a wolf is one to do. That move is stupid strong. Yeah, it has a bit of startup to it, but you can space it correctly. Absolutely, you know, if you just like, you know, you just space yourself properly and you like mix yourself up a little bit, you know, it's it's really not that hard of a move to exactly land in certain situations. Is that back air, uh, not back air, whatever that up tilt, whatever. Well, I looked away for like a second, okay? Whatever it was, it's gonna be able to do it. He got hit and he died. Yeah, he dead now. He dead now, boys. Ralphie searching a little bit with that forward smash, but he can't afford to do that because Wolf's forward smash is incredibly fast. And like I said earlier, if you space it on shield properly, it is safe on block. But instead, not going to want to commit to too much. Jackal, of course, just tacking on that damage slowly with the F tilt. 
forcing his advantage, not pressing too many unsafe buttons. He wants to get as much damage on the stock as he possibly can. And he is already 50% on Ralphie's second stock right here. Trying to tag that up to more 61, even up to a 73. Well, he's still sitting pretty on his first at about 145. And there you see the spacing on the forward smash right there. A lot of other characters wouldn't be able to afford to do Ooh, something like that. But Wolf is definitely going to be able to do that. Jackal doing yeah. a wonderful job at forcing his advantage right now. Whenever you're edge gutting Wolf, you always have to make sure you're in position to like not get hit by side B or react to it. Because mm -hmm. you know that's going to be like the one like trump card Wolf has to try to reverse the situation. Absolutely. Ooh. That was actually interesting DI. I think that was optimal DI, but it was really impressive that it was optimal DI because he got hit from like the back hit of like the up tilt as that back throw. Oh, never yeah. mind. I looked away. Yeah, Jackal, uh, Jackal took a good back throw. Oh, wow. My goodness, the max rage probably coming out from uh, Jackal right there. I assume that's how that was able to kill at such a percent. Now Ralphie all of a sudden with a hell of a hill to climb. Yeah. Gonna have a long, long uh, reverse three stock if he's gonna wanna, if he wants to win, take this. Yeah, just Jackal showing Ralphie right now, just everything the wolf touches, that is your kingdom. <laughs> and you, my son, <laughs> shall go forward and inherit it. What about that one dark spot over there? That's all, that's Jackal's, that's his domain. Oh, okay. Might as well be. I mean, yeah. this, this is like he is just playing like a hyena right now. Still sitting pretty on his first stock. Already tacked Ooh, 100 nice on the second. He finally Ralphie. loses it at about 200%. And Jackal just looking incredibly poised to take this game. Ralphie's going to need some sort of crazy hat trick. And it looks like he's starting it now with these bread and butter wolf combos. Oh, a little uh, slow down on the dash attack. Yeah, a little slow on that tech chase. Um, oh, okay. okay. All right, dude, All right, Jackal, yeah. you, you, want, you want to relax for a second? You don't, don't feel yourself too much. All right? Ralphie is a wonderful player, and if there's anybody who's going to be able to mount this comeback, I think it is definitely him. As that down tilt, it's going to be able to force him off real quick. And he already has about 100% on this stock right here. Actually in forward smash range to be able to kill towards the ledge. But that might not matter. Jackal already taken more, yeah. but the quick neutral air to be able to yeah. get him off. No back airs here, boy. Jackal tried going for like a three to double jump, and he was right, but he was coming in with an air. Yeah. He was too close and got hit. In the back though, not gonna be able to do it just yet, but I don't know if Ralphie's gonna be able to eat another one of those and the F-Tilt gonna be able to take that stock. Jackal actually popping off a little bit. I know he saw his fist bump just a tad. Able to pretty solidly take that set over uh, over uh, Ralphie right there. Yeah, the I mean, he was about, definitely um, forcing his advantage properly. And look the at the spacing. The thing about shot side B is that he Ooh. doesn't grab the ledge immediately like most characters. So you can you can usually hit him with like a low, a low profiling move. The spacing on that F-Tilt was absolutely immaculate. Yeah. 